Kate Middleton had a furious row with Meghan Markle after the former actress beat a member of her staff, it has been claimed. The Duchess of Cambridge allegedly told Meghan, 37, it was unacceptable to target her aides before May's royal wedding in Windsor. Kate, 36, is reported to have told Prince Harry's bride to be, they're my staff and I speak to them, the Sun reported. The reported row comes amid rumors of a rift between the two duchesses, which have emerged since it was announced that Harry and Meghan would move out of Kensington Palace. A source told the newspaper, Meghan, and Kate fell out when she be Ed Kate's staff. It's a tricky situation but it was a one-off and they are determined to maintain a positive relationship even though they are obviously very different in their approach. Kensington Palace has reportedly denied the claims. Kate is also claimed to have been left crying in a stressful dress fitting in the lead-up to the wedding in May. In addition sources have also told the Mirror that insiders are concerned about Meghan's authoritative and abrupt style. It comes after claims from royal sources that Meghan clashed with Buckingham Palace over the smell at St. George's Chapel, where she married Prince Harry. Insiders claim that Meghan wanted air fresheners to be used in the 15th century chapel but was told it was not appropriate. The palace is said to have told her that the chapel was a regular place of worship for the Queen and that it would be good enough for Meghan. The source said, apparently Meghan didn't like the smell of the chapel, which, as you would expect, is a little musty. It's not unpleasant at all, though. It just smells how you would expect an old building to smell. And that's something the royal family are particularly used to. Meghan wanted staff to go around with these atomizers like spritzer guns, and spray the chapel with scent before anyone arrived. Royal household staff stepped in and told her office politely, but firmly, that this was the Queen's chapel and it simply wasn't appropriate. I don't believe they said no because they thought it could affect the chapel in any way. It was simply the principle of the thing. This is a place that has held royal weddings, funerals and even contains the royal vault. I don't believe a request of that nature had been made before.